Hello guys, Tati here. Welcome back to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Let's keep going. Ooh. All right, so this is a little tiny bit loud for me. Okay. <laughs> I'm wearing my headset this time, so uh, okay. Trying to remember the controls here, so I might suck a little bit at beat combat because it's been a couple of days and this is one of those games that you stop playing it and you don't, you know, you don't practice, <laughs> then you're kind of screwed. But hopefully I won't suck that bad. Oh, not these things. I suck so bad at fighting these. Oh my god. Okay. Oh uh, no 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 no! Come on! Don't don't even play! Don't even play with me! All right. Ooh! Ooh! God damn it! Raiden! No! <laughs> Off with your arm. Uh, 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 uh. You keep scrapping me, the fucker. God damn. Cut his legs off, come on. Uh, uh, where is he? Are you serious? There we go, finally. Oh my god! Oh. Okay, so those guys are like my arch enemies. I like they're so difficult to fight. No joke. Right. Let me check something. Oh, there's gonna be two more over there. Oh, that's great. I see a maintenance cat one. Use it to conceal yourself if necessary. I'll try. Okay, can I get this guy? Yes, I can! Fighting one of them, like one by one, it's not bad, it's not as bad, but when you're fighting like multiple at a time... How can I get this guy? <laughs> Alright, we did it. Now remember, there's gonna be another section. Yeah. It's gonna be another section where these guys are gonna be patrolling and uh, yeah it's gonna be a little bit more complicated what's in here nothing really there's nothing here nothing Oh, it's one of those VR missions that you can do. Okay. Actually, there's some audio logs, audio conversations we can get. Um, but it does talk more about, you know, previous game in the series. And uh, I, I don't know if I'm really going to listen to those because... Right. There is a boy in the sewers. Okay. Because there is... Um, there are some people that never played the other game, so that might spoil something. And I mean, I know, I understand, you know, the games are really old, so if people haven't played them, it's not really... Like, it, it's their loss, but... <laughs> Still... There we go. Oh no, they're still alive! Oh, there's a certain weapon that I really want to get. Maybe after this chapter. Ah, there we go. It. Uh. Put that. 
I just saw that in the corner of my eye. All right, cutscene. Now, fighting more than one of these guys is also not a good thing, and I can't reach. There we go. Do we have the... Yes, we do. Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, let, let's not... These goddamn little annoying things. God damn it, I missed it, but it was totally worth it. Oh, come on. Okay, I want to see if I can do it faster this time. Yes! <laughs> Cowabunga! <laughs> Woo! Sick, man. Sick! <laughs> I just hit my headset. <laughs> what you say? Oh. We are Guyanese from Guyana. You speak English? Uh, yeah, I'm from America. Call I'm Portuguese. <laughs> we need George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America president. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Me? What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm looking for bad guys. Ah, damn Skunter Research Lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, I love his accent. You're not one of them Skunt, nah? Nah. Nah, I guess you're all right. If I just saved you. Borg, you know who Day is? Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, maybe live on the street, rake and scraper above, nah? Then this good knee dressed like the mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What the worst gonna happen, nah? But that mother scum don't put me on a rass boat. They pack us all a pickable dirty container. Next thing we know, we're here at the Jumbi lab. All kids like you? Yeah, a lot of boy. But then me been over here, what them scum want to do? Snuff us out and got all day all game. So you ran. Uh-huh. It's shame me not a bad ass robot ninja man. Same as you. Ha! <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. You're starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just playing, nah? Me done plenty bad thing. But me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say. IOD's brain would get cut out. Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. 
George, I need every detail about how you escaped. Oh. And he's gone. <laughs> so the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah. He says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a Desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a sentry cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find a server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need, as well as a little peek at the level of their technology. So what about the kid? I made sure the area was secure and told him to sit tight. Can you pick him up? Sure. I'll send a couple agents for him. You just focus on getting into that lab. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Agreed. Riding out. Finally, let's get into some gameplay. Heavy UG activity ahead. Oh, it is great. possible they are conducting test operations while the lab is closed. They're not going to make it easy to get into that lab. Is there some way you could sneak past? This is what I was talking about. It's this part right here. It's It's a box. How's that gonna help? Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work, actually. Yeah, it could work, but I don't know if I want to try. Yes, we could try. There we go. Okay, we we can. Take care of this guy down here. That dude shouldn't see me. Let's make my way back up here. Yeah, this is pretty goofy and we all know how to do that dude just almost saw me. I don't think he does the... Uh, I think we should be fine here. It should be fine if, if we have to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see me from there. I think it should be fine if we have to fight two at the same time. But if we don't, you know what I mean? That's... Even... Ah, fuck. I guess it's fine. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> I think yeah, the dude still didn't see me or something. Woo! Okay, yes, yeah, stealth in this game. I mean, you can do it, but it, it's eh, it's not very good. <laughs> Where's the dude? Uh. There was another dude. There he is. Why is he down there? Was there... Was I that extremely lucky? Now we're gonna fight. Ah! <laughs> Crazy. No, 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 no. Ooh, come on. I could swear I defended that one. Right, one arm gone. Another arm gone. Ah, shit, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't actually see that. Ooh! Wasn't I defending that? Cut his legs off, my dude. Ah. That's fine. It is fine. Okay, I do want to change this to... What is this? Don't care. Uh, I'm going to change this to... Yeah, let's change it we to that one. We intercepted call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your soliton radar. Actually, you can I... engage if you wish. No. It is your choice. No, I, I don't... No, I don't care. <laughs> to be honest, I know that kind of, like... Yeah, but I don't... <laughs> 
I wanna get to that side. If I can. Hit! I think this is the way we gotta go anyway. So let's try not to fall. Because the camera can be tricky here. Wait, I wanted to see what's over here. Is this where we came from? No, it's not. This is gonna lead us somewhere else that I don't know. Maybe it's the place we have to go. There's a door. Can we open this? We can. I have determined the approximate location of the lab based on the boy's information. It is marked on your Soliton radar. It uh yeah that would have put us back here i think there we go that's the lab big wall projection excuse me pretty well hidden i gotta say are you serious raiden How the fudge did that not see me? Hold on a minute. Yeah, we don't need to fight that dude over there. It would be more of a hassle than anything else. appear to be the UG maintenance area. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UGs. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. But first you need to take a dump. I... wait, what? A dump? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlay to control the proxy UG. All right, let's give it a shot. You need to take a doom. <laughs> I love this game. Uh, what? A doom. <laughs> Wait a minute. Right. We gotta go down there and fight, right? Oh, come on, I totally cut that. Come on, boys. Seriously? You didn't see me? I'm making... I'm here making stylish moves and you didn't see me? Alright. I mean, it works for me. Whatever. You didn't realize your buddies were gone? <laughs> Seriously? I mean... Yes. Ah, you'll make me proud. Yeah. Not shoot at me. Ah, oh, you have one of those arms. Whew. That's 
how you do it. I got an A! Yay! <laughs> oh, come on! For now, yeah. But that room, those were cyborg brain casings. Duh, we saw. George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes, this must be why they are trafficking children. Perhaps other organs are being sold elsewhere, but they are definitely taking their brains. Jesus, are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait, the cyborgs you've been fighting, did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So, what? Desperado's just doing the surgeries there? We've got to do something about all those brains. And the other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. Well, hopefully. Right. Let's do this. Man, Raiden looks so fucking cool. I'm not very familiar with the Metal Gear Solid games. Um, but... It is all ours. Now, use it to locate a data input terminal. I know that Raiden... Any funny business? And they might just open fire. From what I heard, um, I know that Raiden... Goddamn, can I talk? Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. He used to be one of the most hated characters in the series because of... I think it's MGS2. So... And now he's one of the most beloved characters. Uh, and a lot of it, I think, it's because of... Oh, shit. Hello. A lot of it, I think, it might be because of MGS4. Oh, thanks for just kicking me. <laughs> no! MGS4, because he was a badass when he appeared in MGS4. Ah, there's more over here. And... Of course, this game. I think this game was really like the uh, the point where people started looking at Raiden like a different way. So, if I'm wrong, you know, let me know. But because I'm not very familiar with the MGS series, but I do love this game, and uh, I do love four. I did play four, but it was years ago, so everything's a little bit muddy. Maybe that's a game I could replay. I don't know. I mean, I've been I've been replaying through a lot of older games, so you know that could be one of them. Don't know if I would record it because it's it's a game that has a lot of long cutscenes and and I don't know. I I think just for commentary sakes, I don't think it would be like the be the best game to at least for me. I don't know how I would do commentary on that game to be honest. Hey, I got a D. <laughs> I got a D in probably what it is, the easiest mission in the game. And such into the UGs. Let's try using it to access the lab server. I got a D. Was it because I got kicked and seen? Raiden, I found something. In one of the Sentry Cyborg's visual locks. Guess who shows up? Patch it through. Right away. <laughs> Scoop. <laughs> All 
right. You made your point. Oh, <laughs> thank you for understanding. Say what you have now. I will destroy any unharvested inventory. Okay? But have you any idea what they cost? Last night, I checked. Children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Wow. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here for them and the cities they burden. But just gathering the donors required a significant investment. Yes, yes. yes you'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we will dispose of our inventory the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. Takunse is a demanding mistress, and America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? Imani's killer. Desperado's chief of operations goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. The kids. Think we're too late? Only one way to find out. George was still alive. Maybe the payment hasn't come through yet. Mm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. He definitely seemed familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. Okay. Oh, I have to fight these things now. They're not hard, they're just annoying to fight. That's why I don't like it. Especially when they grab onto you. I think we're gonna have a mini boss fight over here somewhere. I think... Oops. <laughs> Wrong button. Can you imagine an open world game where you play as Raiden? Like this, it'd be so cool and you can make improvements in your armor and your sword and... Ah oh, man, it's just be so cool. I know he appeared in MGS5, uh, but they gave him a gun. <laughs> Bad news, Raiden. We can't find George. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off? No way. I merged the GPS location of our entry with all my movement data from that point on. This is bad. You think they got to him first? I don't know. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Now, I, I don't know if it was a full story DLC or if it was just... You know, here's Raiden as a playable character in MGS5. I don't know because I haven't finished that game, to be honest. It wasn't one of my favorites. It was fun, but eh, I don't know. It's just something missing. Um, and I noticed they gave Raiden a gun instead of his sword, so I'm just like, no. <laughs> no. Right, let's go. Yeah, this is the mini boss part. Yeah, alright, let me just see something. There's one thing there. Excuse me. Nothing up here? Ah, it's one of these. Anything here? The bastard is blocking the way. Push that thing back. I know it is. Alright, let's go fight it. I hate it when it does that! Come on! No, not what I meant to do, sorry.
an S. Holy crap. Ah, I had to pause right there, guys. So sorry. Someone was at my door yet again, so... Right. All right. I knew I'd seen that guy before. Stephen Armstrong. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. They're already talking about him as a shoe-in for the nomination in 2020. And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury investigated his ties to a certain private... World Marshal. One of the biggest PMCs out there. I remember. The biggest, ever since the Big Five split up. Not to mention the single largest investor in military cyborg R&D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshall and Desperado in bed together. <laughs> Should make for some fun headlines. Headlines? This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking about. There won't be any headlines. Even without the Patriots filter, no major media outlet will investigate allegations like these. It'd be financial and political suicide. So we just what? Sit back while they keep carving up kids, stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs? You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Kev. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit them first and hit them hard where it counts. No, Raiden, no. I know what you're thinking and just no. Colorado is in America, and America has these things called laws. Mm-hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to... Marshall, yes, so what? There are still laws, and it's their headquarters, for Christ's sakes. You'd be heading right into the heart of a raging shitstorm. I didn't say it would be easy. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus Christ! Kevin, out! I can't believe I got an ass in that fight. Right, let's go. Save these kids. Ooh, I can hear the music already. Hello. Woo, right what I needed. Some heals. Whoa. Right, is there anything over here? Yes. That's a box. Am I going the right way? Yep. No, oh, another call. An artificial blood cryo preserver. They must have begun preparatory freezing. What do you mean? That device is filled with synthetic blood plasma. It can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ, circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels. You can preserve an arm, a brain, any body part for several hours. So what are they freezing, and why? I could not say. Perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of. Unbelievable. You had best hurry, right? Right. Well, I would if you weren't, like, talking to me every five seconds. And I didn't, you know, <laughs> go off to do extra things. Cutscene. Anesthetic in smaller doses. But breathe too much of it. <laughs> and adios, muchachos. <laughs> Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out. <sighs> Surrender. Or decide. The needs of the many, or the needs of the few. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo! <laughs> Surrender! 
I won't ask again. George, are you sure? Hmm? I'm ready. Me life now so precious. Ching. What if we can take this scunt to hell with me? Kayate. Alright, I gotta see. So... I mean, I thought I was gonna get something better. Is my controller... Are you serious? Now my controller disconnected. God damn, like, what's gonna happen next? Uh, I was about to say, before I did that cut, that, um, yes, in that, in that scene, Raiden actually cut down both the doctor and George and you guys are about to see what happens next so yeah oh I unlocked the mariachi uniform which I will never use it <laughs> so but yeah I gotta see I thought I would get something a little better customize Raiden's body yes we can do that uh, like I said I'm not going to uh, change Beast body. I'm gonna keep with the main one. Let's see if we can upgrade our life here. We can. Uh, do I want any skills or do I want to upgrade my weapon? Actually, I know what I want. I want this. Hehe. <laughs> there we go. So two there. Uh, main weapon. Which we can also pick the uh, fox blade if we can buy it. But again, not gonna do that. My controller disconnected again. Hold on, guys, because this is really getting annoying. Hold on, just a second. Okay, guys, so this time my damn controller shouldn't disconnect anymore because it's wired now. Uh, very annoying, so I'm hoping you guys can see all of this. I'm probably gonna re restart the, the, you know, the recording so we don't have any problems in case I cannot, uh, in case this part that I'm recording right now that you guys are seeing, if everything goes right, is messed up because of it, so. Did that even make sense, like what I just said? <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah, so that was one episode. I think we should be fine with that episode the way it is. And yeah, we're gonna go into the next one. But for now, I'm gonna stop right here. And meet me here for the next one. Peace.